There's no doubt in my mind that 2011 holds such a sense of expectancy from what God has planned for us. The Spirit's words and what he's been speaking to our hearts. Well, church, I want you to know, get ready. God's got some great things out ahead. And one of the keys for us to navigate and really receive everything that he's bringing to us is fasting and prayer. You know my passion for fasting and prayer. You know how significant it is in every facet of our lives. I want to encourage you to take hold of the days that are out ahead of us, to press in with all of your heart, to draw near to the Lord. I'm convinced that when we're done with these days of fasting, the shape of our lives spiritually and the shape of this church will never be the same. As the Spirit of God has so powerfully spoken to our hearts, we're to call forth a harvest of the seeds that have been placed within individually and within the corporate life of this congregation. Church, a vast harvest is coming to victory. Let's get our hearts ready. Let's break up the fallow ground. Let's let our hearts be prepared for all that God has. And make no mistake, fasting and prayer is a pivotal way to prepare our hearts for the harvest.